Hey everybody, this is Teddy. My dad is filming this little quick global public servants announcement that in about two months, intellectual property law is going to be completely changed in the United States um, and may very well threaten the heart of the open source movement um, with an act called the America Invents Act, which basically gives a landfall innovation grab to private industry uh, and destroys the inventor in the process of patenting their own ideas and having the right to make a profit from those ideas. And it basically switches the U.S. paradigm of patent law from the first to invent to the first to file, which essentially means that if you were inventing something uh, and playing around with it and were selling it to your neighbors and somebody who has enough money to pay for the patent process, which is about $2,000 or $3,000, um, that then they're the inventor, not you. Um, so this is a serious attack on the people and um, makes it very difficult for the everyday man to, to really make a difference. And it, as far as I can tell, has extremely deleterious effects on the open source movement. Um, it, it really will make it so that what my friend Isaac Wilder is doing and the Free Network Foundation with open internet <clears throat> infrastructure, um, what Marson's doing with the open source uh, ecology and the Global Village construction set, that um, that those could just be you know picked off by any large company. And I was talking to my mom's uh, partner who's inventing a really very important uh, new new programming. Uh, I can't even talk about it. It's like non-disclosure crap. But um, um, he was explaining that Samsung has like thousands of employees just scouring the universe and, and the internet for um, patents that they might be able to push through once this act is, is made valid, which is March 13th, 2013. So 3-13-13 It'll be really important for us to have a people's patenting process, which I've been preparing for, I guess, for a few years and have written down some ideas for it. But um, there's links about the importance of this. And this is one of the three, like, reclaim legal innovations. Um, and we've got to protect our capacity uh, as planetary citizens to invent our solutions because it's what's working. You know, the United States government uses open source for all of its security on all of its computers. Open source now totally outcompetes private enterprise when it comes to making pharmaceutical drugs. So, um, and it's been pretty much like the most effective way for us to share sustainable design in a lateralized, decentralized, democratic manner. So this is our only hope is open source. So um, I really would love to talk to anybody who wants to who would like to protect our right to invent. Um, and it's probably the most awesome part of the American culture. So let's not let that get shot down by a bunch of bureaucrats who don't know what the, you know, their, you know, their butthole from a hole in the ground. So uh, just get in contact with me. You got my info on there online. So thanks for listening.